something first. It feels so good out here right now. Oh my God, Randy, the breeze. I just want to oh. sailing. Oh. Nothing but sailing. What's that word? What's that song? Take me away from here. That, Take uh, me away. Christopher Cross. I yeah, Christopher love Cross. Oh my God, Randy, I'd love to be in like a hammock out there in the. Oh. Uh, suspended the about forest. 40 feet off the ground. No. Yeah. <laughs> no. <laughs> you go up, I'll go down. Hey, you know what I'd like to be? Up on, up on El Capitan. Hanging on the uh, side of that cliff. Us. No. And just relaxing. Oh. Randy, I don't know how they did that. <laughs> you ever been to Yosemite, anybody? Yeah, who's been there? We have, we had the, the, the fortunate. Yeah. Fort, fort, fortune. What am I saying? What are you saying? We had some good luck to get to go there. <laughs> we did have good luck. We went to Yosemite first time. I've been wanting to go since I was a boy. I'm, I'm like 87 years old and I finally got oh, to man. go. You're embarrassing. Oh, what a majestic place, man. Wow. And people were hanging on the El, El Capitan's, what, 3,000 vertical feet. And people were sleeping on the side of that as they climbed up. Took a couple days to climb up that thing. Wasn't that cool? I don't know how in the world. What a beautiful evening. Oh my, I mean, it, I could go to sleep standing here. I'm so tired. I'm like, oh my God. It's been a long week. It has been a lot, but it's been a productive it's been week. been an awesome week, it's man. Been a real, we got a lot done. I can't wait till tomorrow morning. We're going to do some more stuff. Oh, yeah, exactly. Yeah. I'm going right. to do, I'm gonna do yard work at my house. Yard tomorrow. work, yard work. I got to put a dog lot up at your house. I, know. I mean, listen, it's, I know, that's right. For yep. 20 dogs I got. Yeah. Hey, everybody. What are we looking at this for? Hey, let's, let's play pretend. Oh, good. Can we play pretend? So we sure we're going to pretend we're on vacation. I don't want to do that. And we're going to pretend that this little, this little 20 foot freedom, We've rented eight by it. 20, yeah. we're renting it and it's, it's back in the mountains and right on the end of that tongue is a 2,000 foot cliff that later I might be able to bump you off and just, <laughs> hey, like, boop. Hey, Amanda, let's go outside and dance around the cliff. You know what? As much as we argue and go on and stuff, we actually have a really good time on vacation. If we was on vacation all the time, it might be all right. Yeah. Remember this? <laughs> no! No! I'm not going to stand up! <laughs> there ain't no way. John just up our texting. We have a video of Amanda walking out on the cliff of the Pacific Ocean. And we're standing there looking around. She's on all fours grabbing a hold of an iron pipe that's happened to be coming out of the ground, grabbing the whole thing, just strangling that's it. That's what Donna said. She said, just grab the pole. And Travis said, oh, well, I was just thinking about that cliff. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh, it's scary. It that was a great me. video. You got to look that one up on it our channel. It terrified me. And that everybody was asked, they said, why'd you go out there? And I was like, you know, I didn't think it would be as bad, but boy, it was bad. Ugh. I mean, bad. It was awesome. <laughs> It was a little trail and oh. what a beautiful place. Yeah. So we had the the We had a good time out there. Oh yeah. breeze and um, oh even though God. it worked every day, it was just relaxing yeah. to be out there and be away Customers a little bit. Fantastic beautiful people. Yeah. yeah, yeah, that was fun. That was fun. But we're gonna pretend that we're see we got an R V next to us. We didn't, but I'll I'll show it. This is R V. We have a, a uh a guest staying here, mm -hmm. so she's gonna stay in that. And we got another tiny home here, and my cube over here, and we got them everywhere. So pretend, put your pretend, okay. like when you're kindergarten, all right, everybody, put your pretend hats on. <laughs> and we're gonna pretend. But anyway, this is an eight by 20, 32.5 is what we sell it for. Yeah. All right, $32,500. Now there's some upgrades. The uh, Shake Shingles is an upgrade, and the LP siding is an upgrade. Mm -hmm. They got an extra door. There's two doors on this unit. Washer and dryer. Which makes it look really cottagey homey it to does. have two doors like that. Two doors. You guys can see the uh, the shake shingles up there. Beautiful. Yeah. So it adds a little flair. Yeah. You know, add all that to it. You may have, I don't know, what is up 34 or something like that, I guess, you know. So in this, you do get the mini split. You get wood siding if you wanted it. Um, well, the LP is going to be more than that. So he's probably got 35 in it or 36. So, um, but this is on a rental program. Tankless and water heater. Mm -hmm. Washer and dryer, you know, full kitchen, full bathroom. And the customer that bought this house did not design this house. He bought it. It was actually a spec house. Yeah, yep. We designed it, and he liked it, and he bought it. So, um, actually, he wanted a craftsman-style home. Yeah. And it was too too expensive because there's a lot of home in that. Mm -hmm. 
And so after we come out with this design, he said, you know what? I want the freedom style with the dormer. Yeah. So there's a bedroom up, nice living room. They've decorated it and we want to show you the inside of this. Yeah, so and this, it is for rent. This will be an overnight rental. Mm -hmm. Yep, we could actually rent it where it's at. It is hooked up right now yeah. to water power and mm -hmm. sewer. And I didn't think about that, yeah. you know? We haven't mm -hmm. started, we want to officially put it out on the beach, you know, and um, get it renting. Right. But thought we'd run it to you and show you what it looked like. Sure, okay. Ready? Yes. 10-4. Ten four. All right, ten Okay, so I've already described the outside with the, you know, every Freedom and RJO comes with a screen door. Yeah. And, you know, the little roof over the door and the cedar shakes. And um, you can design your home. You can always add little things to it if you want. Mm -hmm. um, this is a, this is your exhaust fan for your bathroom. And I think, isn't this redo in the uh, PSPI was? Yeah. This is PSPI, yep. right? Mm -hmm. Yep. Yep. What I like, if you guys can just look, we put gutters on all our homes. We put a little little awning over the door. It keeps water from dripping down the door if water gets over the awning or the gutter. Outside plug is standard. Let me show it from over here. What's been a big seller for us, it's neat, is you see this big picture window? Yeah. And we even got bigger windows than that if you want a window. But man, can you imagine that? If you've got a little courtyard here and you can look out or you've got on a piece of property or whatever you want, it draws a lot of light in. Yeah. And then this side's more traditional with your, you know, two single hung windows and you got your little kitchen window on the back side. But it's got full appliances for that price, tankless water heater, mm -hmm. your dormer, um, heat and air system. You, and they cool? stayed for probably about three or four days. Yeah, yeah, if not more. Yeah, they were from Utah. Yeah. Yeah, James. James did our, uh, he's from four generations or four yeah. seasons or something. Yeah. Four generations, I think. And it's a uh, ancestry ancestry company that yeah. he will dig up your. Dig up your ancestors? Dig up your ancestors. <laughs> He'll dig up your ancestors. You may not want to dig them up. Yeah. He'll yeah, find if you want to know where you where you come from, who's he's a dude to call. <laughs> yeah. I said, ew. Yeah, ew. Ew. So come on in. Right. Hey, <gasps> come on in, everybody. The water's fine. <laughs> All right. Hey. No. They've got this as a rental, so um. Not sure what they're going to do here. I know that they just put these here temporarily, these chairs. I don't yes. think I don't think Mandy's not going to come here and rent, and we're going to watch TV. <laughs> hey, Mandy! <laughs> oh, you done in there? And I'd say I'm right here. <laughs> I'm just right here. Quit hollering at me. Quit hollering. Look at that window. Oh yeah. Oh, what size? I don't think we told the size, did we? Size what? The size, the size of the house. I said an eight by twenty, thirty-two five. Well, I know it is laborious for you to say it again. So. so what have we done? This is like a day five of this week. I spent almost over five hours with you on these videos this week. Oh my God, I spend way too much time with you. God. Ugh. Ugh. Okay. All right, watch oh, this TV. Show this TV. Yeah, let me show you. Amanda said, hey, Randy, how's that TV work? Well, <laughs> hey. Never... Hey, Amanda, can we watch the TV while you're cooking? While I'm, oh, while I'm oh, cooking. Oh, yeah, I'll cook shit. you. Wow! She said it, everybody. I got her pumped up. <laughs> I'm telling you what, we're at the level of sanity of this. <laughs> at this horse, hour. horse shift. <laughs> Look at this thing. Okay. Whoop! Okay. Ain't that awesome? Please don't drop it. <laughs> <laughs> James and his wife are not watching. Hey, man, you can watch that from the shower. <laughs> and then, hey, up there in the loft, they can watch it. And then I even said, look, the neighbors can watch it out the window. Yes. <laughs> hey, Randy, everybody. Randy, tell, uh, you were walking by, you were going to the cube, which you yeah. were, and you saw them doing what? Yeah, I was going to my cube, my <laughs> eight by nine phone cube. And I was, I and, I, and the homeowners were here, and I walked down and I looked in their window because they didn't have any blinds yet. 
I looked at her and I seen me on the TV. <laughs> they, they were watching. They were watching me on TV. That's so weird. They, you know what? They didn't have no signal. That's why they were watching me. That's the only option they had. Yeah. Here's a fold down table. Well, I'm glad we didn't see it up. Hey, is that a fold down or a flip up? I'd hate it to see it. Is that a flip up or fold down? Fold down. Okay, it that's a up. that's a fold down. It, it flipped. There's it just flipped up. Oh, that's a, 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 I don't know. <laughs> a card. See, we do these super simple. Super we're, simple. We're simple. We're simple people. We're a baby. We're, we're a peaceful, peaceful people. people. Now look at this. Oh gosh. Hey, listen. Hey, have you ever seen a stink bug? See that stink bug? Boo. Oh, stop it. Now look. You're going to turn it up. Look at that, man. Wow. Time for private time. <laughs> private time. <laughs> it's, it's, yeah. it's private time. You're so stupid. No, hey. No TV for you all. <laughs> they don't get to look. <laughs> <laughs> Neighbors don't That's get to see the TV. Hey, but aren't these cool? Look here, everybody. What do you do with All you do is push that button. Oh, you know what David just said? David said, bow, chicka, wow, wow. Bow, chicka, wow, wow. <laughs> There's the signature move. That's it. Randy does the dance move. <laughs> <laughs> well, there's no music. Look, you, you don't look, need music. Look, hit that button. Oh. Done. <gasps> oh, really? Lowe's. Lowe's. Oh, my God. Lows, levelor, levelor, lev. Well, I tell you, levelor, 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 lev, lev, oh, lor, lev, push, boom, go up. Well, ain't that something? Cordless blind. And, and they cut them to fit. Isn't that cool? Well, I want that. Nice. Done. Oh, my kid, I'm never, I'm never gonna do that. What <laughs> <laughs> like, never? Blind. Your dogs would eat the blinds. <laughs> All right. Yeah, Travis wants to know, are those push-up shades or pull-down shades? <laughs> well, Travis, I think it's a push-and-pull system we got here. Get him stirred up, Travis. Now, the owner, James, James, listen to me, James. Here we go. You ready, James? Oh, All right. boy. Yeah, I said, James, what's that up there? Oh, God, here he we said, go. He said, that's a mattress. I said, what's that mattress for? He said, in case somebody wants to sleep down here. I said, okay. Just flop. So I could see Amanda grabbing hold of that mattress and... <laughs> trying to wrestle it down here. She'd have a stroke by the time they got down on the floor. Yeah. Bless his heart. Yeah. Let me tell you what we need to do. Okay, listen. All right, James is mad at me Here's now. A, no, I, he, everybody's mad at you always. Yeah. Here's what we need to do. We need to get one of the tiny houses, the tiniest. Like, we got an 8 by 14 I got, a, I got an 8 by 9 Listen to me. And you and I need to stay the night and, and film it. Yeah, you want to stay in my cube? Get, no. With my dog? No. Got, got a big fridge, though. There's a big bed up there. Yep, big bed. Okay, now. Okay, he's over it. In here, this is a big stackable washer and dryer. That is not expected in here. It is gorgeous, man. Look at that. Well, Walk around the chair, Amanda. Right? Walk around the folding chair. <laughs> James, he ain't going to let you forget about this chair. He's and look here. Complained ever since now the there's walk. a closet. <clears throat> oh, that's, look, you can see the laundry in Oh, there. you can tell his wife did some stuff. I might take that paper off all them hangers in there. Oh, yeah. Isn't that beautiful? They got all kinds of hangers. Yeah. What? I mean, you got to hang a lot of clothes. <laughs> when I go on vacation, I hang all my clothes. Stop. You're so weird. I love you know hanging that? my t-shirts. All right. Do you realize I have been on vacation with you? You do not Ugh. hang up your clothes. And look at this box. They, they even got extra stuff. So I can put, when I come here, I'm going to take my socks out of my buffle bag and put your my socks in here. Out of your what? My buffle bag. <laughs> it's, a, it's a duffel bag. <laughs> you dip. You dip. <laughs> Yo, I'm not the one that said horseshoe peep. <laughs> I've just about tapped out. But look what they've done. Look how they've stocked this thing. All right? Oh, nice. Yeah, look, look, There's Amanda. Look. What? I'm coming. Hey, you remember Elf? They drink, they drink syrup, remember? Yes. Look, they got Aunt Jemima. That My is awesome. Perfect. I love Aunt Jemima. Oh, they got stuff for pancakes. Yep, a toaster. See? Isn't that a cool toaster? Oh, no. You shouldn't know this stuff. 
Oh, I'm gonna sleep in here tonight. No, you are not. OSM OSMR. MR not ducks. Oh look, look how pretty that is. Look at this. They have enough cleaning supplies that you can just clean this whole place for them. Oh my god, you shouldn't know this. Well, I'm sorry in advance, James. Then here, look, look. Batteries. Yep. Oh my gosh. This is the place to be. Well, there's a cord. They've already got a cord. Hmm. James has been double dipping. James (laughs) got two cords. That's two cord James. And this is a bigger kitchen, too. Yes. Look, you can feed. Oh, no. Don't stop. stop. I've contaminated them. I have to wash oh, them all. Here. There's 32 stop. forks in here. Look at the top. Stove top. Did you say 32 forks? <laughs> I love this microwave. Oh, that's, you could. Can you fit I there? can get in there. <laughs> <laughs> oh, God. Isn't that beautiful? And. Oh, they got salt and pepper. Da, 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 da. Oh, the and no spice, but that's okay. Well, you bring the spice. I like this Randy. Look how wide that Randy Rack is. That's a different one. It's a different. Oh, that's different nice. with a TH. Very different. Okay. D- different with a TH. Oh, can you open that door, please? It is open. Not that one. The one behind you. Oh. <laughs> Could be the snake and a bitch. Hey, let's hear. Isn't that cool? I just feel like you're going to tear something up. Look at that. Ah. <sighs> Do you, remember, you can hear the river. Do you remember your dad would say stuff like, uh, was your daddy a glass maker? Because <laughs> I can't see through you. <laughs> Let me see. No. Let me see. Stop. Pop. What? You want to look at the ITH factory? Well, there it is. Hello. Okay. Social, Two doors is very nice. Social distancing, friend. Friend. <laughs> and, all right, the bathroom is aw to die for. All right. All right. Look at this. Oh. Don't step on that. I've got clean shoes. No, don't. I'm clean. No. Look at the barn wood accented. This is what I think got James is the barn wood and all the, the special kitchen, the extra length we had on here, the oh, washer yeah. and dryer, all that. It was a good deal. Yep. Oh, it's really cute. Well, I love the barn wood accent. Brent, Brett actually did this part. Yeah. Yeah. I said, be free, oh, look, Brett. I can see you in the, look, I see you. Be free, Brett. Free, be free. Yep. Well, you know, Brett's from California anyway, so. Yeah, so he's a barn wood in the blood. Well, he's got, he's a free kind of deal. Okay, let me see. Isn't this you nice? Here. Well, I'm trying And this to... is a 32 inch shower standard in all our RJO and Freedom. Now, if, unless you want a bedroom and bathroom or split on the end, we can put a 36. But this okay. fits good when you have a right and left kitchen on the end of the house. Yeah. Isn't that cool? Yeah, no social distancing in the tiny. Super pretty. Super pretty. Yeah. Well, I took up that white rug. You're beat. There you go. Mm-hmm. So, look, look. If you stay there, look how big this is. And this is what's really nice, and that's why James got that bed, because you can actually put a full size bed down here. So we'll probably have a sofa. Uh, he's oh, I know what he's got. He's got a futon coming. Oh, it a just sofa. came, I believe. Okay, good. So that's a great idea because what um. What I like is something like either a futon or a day yeah. bed. So what he said, if you don't want, you know, if the futon's a little uncomfortable, you can take that top mattress and yeah. put on it. So it would be nice. Yeah. And then, so you got two here and then two up in the loft. Yeah. Right. Yep. Now this ladder, what we're going to do, James, sorry you haven't done it yet, but what we're going to do is we haven't done this kind of ladder, but we're going to fasten this ladder right here with two hinges. Okay. I'm going to put a pulley right there, and we're just going to crank this thing up. Oh. And that way it's out of the way, because there's really not a good place to just, you know, screw the ladder. Yeah. Yeah. Yep. Hey, Amanda. Can you get me up yeah, here? Yeah, show the bed up there. Oh, wow. Here. That is a, that looks like a cozy that bed. That is real looking. Real. Real looking real cozy. Looking. Real looking cozy. <laughs> Isn't that? Oh, they got some beautiful bed spreads and look the two windows you can look out isn't that cool yep climb in kids wouldn't that be cool i would have loved to have this when i was a little boy can you imagine climbing up here and staying and little get to look outside all the tiny homes <laughs> and then this is storage on top what? Stop! What i ain't looking mean? at you i ain't looking at you <laughs> here you go yeah. All right. Okay. 
not. That's pretty childish of you, Amanda. Hi, Dana said, get up here, Amanda. Uh, no. <laughs> put this really in a bad place to put it. Now, let me go over a few things that, because we haven't done any really overnight, and James and his wife are really first one, we got, we've got several. I don't know how many, probably six or eight overnight homes probably. are going to be in our community. Yeah. So when they were here, we were talking, and she had made the comment when I got through talking, she wished I'd have said all this before she got the day she got here, but I didn't think about it because we used to own a rental community, mm -hmm. all right, and rental homes and rented them out. So when I was here, I was just brainstorming. I walked in and I said, you know, when you rent this thing out, kind of think about you as a renter and would you come back to this home mm -hmm. and what you would want in this home and what would draw you back to stay, right? Right. And a couple things that we used to do in our cabins, we had a called Brothers Cove, and I know I've said that a lot, but it's on, uh, it's on the internet if you'd like to look it up. It's a, sure. it's a resort that I uh, built. But we had a book inside every home, and you could write on there a little testimonial of your stay and what you liked you know, about the home and stuff. And so I, thought, I told them, I said, you know, it'd be nice to either the coffee table what we had in the log homes, sure. but if we had a little stand right here, mm -hmm. I think it'd be neat to put the book right there. Sure. You know, and you could write on there, hey, this is what I, you know, I enjoyed to stay, enjoyed your tiny home. Mm -hmm. Also, it's, it's nice to sometimes help the guests that come to this area. What is the local sights and sounds? Where can they go? Where's a great burger? What do you have to say? Yeah, see? where can you yeah. get a good barbecue? Where's a good place for an ice cream, whitewater rafting? Mm -hmm. Sometimes it's good to put together a portfolio sure. for all the local areas and, and places. That helps people saying, wow, when I came there, I knew everything what to right. do. Also, you can have a owner's closet. If you wanted to take maybe one of the cupboards and put a lock mm -hmm. on it, or even for us to put you one, you got an owner's closet. So when the, when the people come to clean your home after mm -hmm. the guests are gone, what happens is they can be instructed by, hey, put some chocolates out for our guests. Put them on the bed or, you know, put them out, mm -hmm. maybe some snacks or drinks in the fridge, stuff like that. And you've got an owner's closet is also a good thing to have if you're going to rent your home out. A couple other things is, um, and they did, they put complimentary coffee mm -hmm. in here for all the guests that Those come in. Basic. basic stuff that just makes them feel good. So Salt, if they get in, pepper, sugar. yeah, if they get in late at night and they check in, they get up the next morning, what's the first thing you would want yeah. in a home? Mm -hmm. Well, I want to fix some coffee. First thing I get up, gets me stirred up. I'm good. So a lot of personal touches. I told them what would be nice too. <clears throat> is maybe put a picture, maybe a picture of them, mm -hmm. or maybe maybe not a picture of you. You might want to put a little, a little uh, something on the wall that says, hey, welcome to our home. Mm -hmm. We're the, you know, we're such and such. Um, we live in, you know, they live in Utah. They say, we live in Utah. We're so excited about our home. I hope you enjoy our home. I hope you enjoy being our guests. We thank you so much. Please feel free to leave us a quote, a note of, of what you thought of our home. Right. So a lot of times, or, any, or you know, how would you <clears throat> improved it? You know, what what was you know, just some pros and cons, so they can look at it too. Or describe who you are. Yeah. They would like to know who owns this place. Mm -hmm. You know, say, hey, we live in we live in Utah, and we snow ski, or you know, I I don't get out of bed till on Saturdays until one, and you know, stuff like that. Explain who you are. I yeah. think it'd be kind of cool. You yeah. know. So, what else did I tell them? There was something else. Um, and two, you know, adding stuff, you know, like the one uh, rental that we looked at with the uh, the grapevines and stuff, you want to make your house look so they'll remember it. Hey, yeah. do you remember that house that blah, 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 that was in? And also, you can also maybe try to hide something and maybe have like a little game. That's true, play, yep. Play a little game with them. Say, hey, there's something there that, you know, blah, blah, blah. Could be inside, outside, could be around it or something. It just make a fun game of the house. That's true. We've started to do that or thought about doing it before, didn't we? Yeah. yeah. Uh, also, and Janet, we did that as well. Some of our homeowners did at Brothers Cove. They would pick a theme of a house. You could do Gone yeah. with the Wind. You could do Mickey Mouse. You could do... Well, we got one here called the Mad Hatter. Yeah. The, we're getting ready to uh, build one of those. Yep. The Mad Hatter. Yep. And, so you could do all kinds of things to just make it fun. And now you can grow into this home. Okay. Yeah. Now, for one, where the TV is, mm -hmm. there can be a shelf up here, right? Yeah. And I know they're kind of um, bygone mm -hmm. era. They're not anymore as DVDs. Mm -hmm. 
but they're still kind of cool to have. Yes. So if they had a DVD player here, they could have some DVDs Just there. Just in case something, the, something goes out, uh, somebody, they're giving some suggestions. Name the tiny home. Of course, that's a yeah. great... Always uh, name it. Always. Uh, games for when it rains. Box games. Perfect. Yes, exactly. That's a great... Yep. Box games, cards. Yeah. All that stuff. And you leave that here for the guests. Yeah. And you replace things and... You put something in here that you would want if you came and exactly. stayed. Exactly. And what I'm going to do for, because Travis, he's too young. He's a baby. He doesn't know about Gone with the Wind. We'll do, what about a Star Trek house for uh, Travis? He likes sci-fi stuff. Yeah. That's Star Wars. Star Wars or Star Trek. I never watched Star Trek. I know. Star Trek's great. It's good. But you wouldn't like it. No, 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 no. Stop it. <laughs> That's Mork from Mork. Mork and Mindy. <laughs> Poor old Robin Williams, dead as a hammer. Was Spock in Star Trek? Yeah. That was okay. Spock. Yeah. Spock. Yeah. Yeah. So all those personal touches <laughs> really help. Yeah, it does. So Good. And, and like we've said before, you will not believe the people that email us, call us, say, hey, I want to I need somewhere to stay while my house is being built. Yep. I want to bring my family. We want to tour the houses, stay for the weekend. So we're going to yeah. have... We're going to be able to fill up these houses. Yeah, we sure are. And yeah. um, also, think about when it comes to money, mm -hmm. this is 32.5. 32.5 is enough. You don't need any more than what that 32.5 is, right? Yeah. Think if you bought it, you put it on one of the lots, mm -hmm. you rent it out for two years, you could possibly knock off three quarters of the debt yeah. and be paid that much it's off. something to consider isn't it that really cool is. think yeah. about it it would not work if this house was 90 grand 80 oh. grand 65 grand no. you have it options. wouldn't work mm -hmm. right and you know eight by 20s like this sometimes are up 50 60 70 thousand so 32 five you could actually maybe almost pay this thing off in two to three years yeah crazy all right, all right. let's go i'm gonna turn the lights off we're gonna head to the shop the house is on. Nobody's home. <laughs> well, I turned them on. Oh, okay. There's lights everywhere. Lord. Good. Lights out. Let's do it. Hey, let's go hiking, Mandy. Well, We're on vacation. Let me lock. Oh, you got it locked. Oh, you're already on it. I'm always on it. Oh. All right. Listen, Dana, she said we want to see Chuck's uh, container decorated. So do I, whenever I can get out of the office to... Yeah, turn it into a jungle room. So I Randy, don't tell nothing. What? You such a big mouth. What did I say? I told you this the other day. Randy should have been a woman because he's a tattle L of everything. <clears throat> I'm sorry, ladies, but women talk. Man, that's sexist. Well, I can't help it. Well, I've raised. Go, hey, just go oh, on out there. Okay. Right there. Buddy, come on. Good boy, come on. Where is he at? Oh, he's grabbing his little toy. Where are you at? Come on, Ace. Come on, buddy. Ace. Good boy. Wow, it's quiet in here. Oh, it is so quiet. Oh. You get right in the middle. It echoes. And, uh, and then I go right here. Hello. And you don't hear it. Hello. And then down in there about that high. Bryce stood right in the middle of it, and it echoed. That's so cool. Isn't that neat? Hey, hey, come on. Let me show you what's happened in this home. We were in here. This is a reverse loft. Show the outside of it. Reverse loft. This is the Leo 8 by 22. Okay. And I know I'm saying the, the word wrong. This is our investor home. It'll be gone and out of here 
um, next week. But come on over here and let's show you what's going on with it. A lot of changes next week. Yeah. That door's got the pins on it. But it's got the dormer 8 by 22. All right. Come on in, everybody. This is the reverse loft. Oh, my goodness. Isn't that cool? Oh, look, everybody. That's pretty. Here, that, Randy, move over. I mean, you know, That's what she you're, said. You're cute and all, but. That's what she said. Move over. <laughs> Isn't that neat? That is very neat. Guys, that good. is so cute. So this is a barn door. Yes. And not all barn wood got turquoise. Mm -hmm. Okay, it comes in any kind of colors. We just grab it and growl. I love that. Hey, buddy. That is cute. Let's, Let's go put inside. Back in there. Yeah. Come on, Ace. So pretend this is like you've got crawling up in your loft. Oh, uh, yeah, you got all kinds of headroom in here. Look. A lot of headroom. What's up, buddy? I don't know what. All kinds of barn wood. Look at that on the wall. Yeah, around the windows, the wall. Yeah. Good boy. That They just wanted a little splash. Yeah. What do you think, buddy? No, no, no. That's cool. Yeah. All right, let's go. I love that. Come on. Ready? You ready? Let's go. Good boy. I gotta give oh, you a look behind, I'll show this in a minute behind me. I gotta give him a bath. And they put a handrail, which is kind of neat, isn't it? Look, look how they that did that. Oh, that's nice. That's a chunky one. Oh, I good. like that. Remember Anthony was in here last night? Yes. You know? They've been working at night. Yep. And this is the reverse loft. So this will be the living room up here. Oh my god, I love that. You know, it kind of gives it. It kind of, yeah, it kind of gives it another room, yeah. but it's open too. Oh my God, how cute. Wow. Let me come up there. I like this. I do too. I like it a lot. Oh, you can have a nice little cozy something to watch TV. A little cozy something? A cozy. Ah! Look. Look what they did with this with the, for the mini split. Yep. And then the mini to split. Hide the, yep. The line set. Well, I'll be. Wow. You know what, Amanda? After they get all eight homes, we're gonna have to go down there and do a tour. We're oh, we should. We'll go visit all, going to all eight of them and go visit all of them. I love it. After they decorate it. Yeah, right? decorate it. Let me show this. Because you're not gonna have time to decorate these. Oh no, they gotta go. Yep. Oh my God! Look at the door. Neat. Let me shut Over. that door for you. Oh my you. gosh! Look how big blocks the shelves are. Yeah. Look, big, big arr, hunk. What do you say, gnarly? Gnarly, man. Gnarly. Gnarly, dude. Oh my gosh, super cute. Yep. And we build these barn doors. This is a, a eastern white pine, and then they threw a little bit of barn wood on it, it just to give so it some nice. look. Yeah. And this is a rental. Yep. And then inside is a tiled tub shower, Amanda. Oh my God, I know, I'm coming. Will's been in here. If Will's been in, been in there, it's gorgeous. Yeah. A tiled tub shower, a big kitchen, right? A living room. I'm show the kitchen right here real quick. A living room, a bedroom on the main floor. Oh, what think size about, again? That's kind of okay. cool, 8 by 22. Wow. So think about it. You've got a bedroom on the main floor, mm -hmm. a full living room, right? Yeah. And that, just the same kitchen any, anywhere else, right? Big kitchen. Big kitchen. And... Look at the size of this bathroom. I didn't say, look at the countertop. That is so cool. And the, the big blocks of wood. Crazy. <laughs> Those are so, look how thick. They're like two inches oh, I wish thick. you could do a video just on this house. Well, let me show this. And then look at, you've got a full-size uh, soaking tub, right? Shower. Yes. Big bathroom. Toilet, vanity. And this is the outside shower and a tankless water heater. Oh, my goodness. Let me get over here in the corner. Wow. There's I'm, at, I'm standing where the toilet is. Now, do you think they would buy eight tiny homes? They bought eight. If they didn't think this was, you know. Well, they know the market. They know. How much we're, they're paying yeah. for it, what their revenue costs on it. And they have spent extra money, of course, on the tile, the extra dormer, <clears throat> and just a few things on here. That's not a bad idea, Dana. Dana said uh, they could add a hinged spice rack over the electrical box in the kitchen. That could be a great little add-on. 
There's so many add-ons. They're so, so cute. Yep. Big old bathroom. Wow, wow, wow. Beautiful. Yeah, I like that idea because they could do a lot of storage right there. Yep. All kinds of stuff. Oh, yeah. Super cute. Oh, yeah. Okay. Love it. Oh, we have to go down there. Down where? Uh, oh, and tour it? Yeah. Yeah, well, it's, it's going to be in North Georgia. North Georgia has mountains. That's the, kind of the last span of the Appalachian oh, Mountains. I'd love to see it. Yeah. Yeah. This is nice. Okay. You guys done? We are done. All right. I think... Hey, I got a question. Oh, no, because there's a door. Never mind. Oh, I just seen Stevie's house. Okay, I'm not going to say anything. But um, I was going to ask a stupid question, but I'll ask it anyway. Um, so you don't, when you have a bedroom in the living room, you don't have to have an egress window because you have the door. Duh. I'm tired. That's all right. <laughs> I'm not going to show that until we walk over there. Okay. Mm. This is the other house. This is, this is, uh, Miss Wilman? Yeah. Okay. Right? Yeah. Wilman? Yep. I That's think. her house. Yep. Um, the inside, we got the outside done here. Underneath there, the inside is done. This is a, now this was really unique because this is a 10 by 20 RJO. Mm -hmm. What a deal but with our prices. The one's got the entryway. Yep. This one has, this layout is crazy. What, I mean, you, how can you beat this? You can't. Look There's how so big, look how big this room is. I've walked into an entryway. We have been in this quite a bit for everybody, all right? We got tools in here, but it's pretty much done. We got a barn door to put up in the bathroom a little bit. But, the kitchen cabinets, Rob's finishing them up. We probably got maybe a day in here. But oh, look at the right. size of this, man. She has really maximized her space in this. You house. can't beat a 10 by 20. And this is an RJO. And we were able to put a window up there so you can actually have that as a bedroom. Oh, so if you've got grandkids or if you've got a guest, they can sleep up there. Yeah. And then here is way big enough room for a sleeper sofa oh, yeah. or a Murphy bed or anything in here. Oh, yeah. You know what? She can put whatever she wants in this house. Oh, full-size sofa. Everybody's wondering where Ace is at. <laughs> he ran out of the house before. He was eating that rug up here in a minute. <laughs> and it's got a big shower. Yes. Now, she told me she was old, but I don't think what she told me was old. She's going to be just fine. This is beautiful. Oh, this is great. Yeah. Plenty toilet room. shower yeah and tankless water heater can't beat it where's the kitchen going real quick show it again at the end at the end Tracy. down here this is all kitchen right here refrigerator of course sink every countertop isn't this beautiful oh and i meant to oh you know what i forgot that was a question i was going to answer and i'm sorry i forgot it but what size bed was that in james's house oh I, was that a, a, a queen? i think it was a queen I, i'm almost positive it yeah. was a queen I'm sorry I didn't answer that. Yeah, I, I think it was to. a queen. Yep. Okay. And because right. somebody just said that she can get, Lord, she can get a queen, but a uh, king bed. Apart. You can get a king. Well, it's it's 115 inches across. Okay. And I think it's a nine foot loft. Love it. Ace, come here, buddy. Oh, there he is. I've got him all. Listen, he can't get out. I've got all the doors locked down and everything. Oh yeah, we're all locked down in here. I made sure before we came on. Yeah. All right. This is the other. This is an eight foot for the investor. They had an RJO, regular RJO. And oh, it's not Anthony. He just said, love you guys, watch you all the time from Australia. Hello, Anthony. Yeah, hello, hello, Mike. Stop it. Hello, Mike. Stop. I like my buddies down under, I do. Yeah. Hey, oh, cheer, I crowd. I shouldn't have said that. I go down there and have a little brew. Stop. <laughs> I do. I'm I'm sorry, Listen, Anthony. if there was anybody that was born to be Australian, it was me. You know what? Crickets. They're they're a <laughs> they're a leathery crowd. A leathery crowd. Yeah. I, I mean, like I watched leathery. I watched a documentary on some farmers down there. It's like God, I like these people, man. I do. Always. I almost moved to Australia when I was 21 years old. You told me that. Yep. Right. They were giving land away, 450 acres. If you come and homestead it, <laughs> they'd give it away. So me and my buddy thought, well, the only way we're going to go down there was going to be, I carried oxygen tanks to people that were, right. you know, in medical supply. Mm -hmm. So we went to school, night school, to be respiratory therapists. And uh, 
but it was at a junior college and we didn't make it. <laughs> we failed. Wah, wah, wah. We didn't become respiratory therapists. <laughs> so I didn't get to go to Australia. We well, were gonna you, you tried. We were gonna farm and keep yeah, four hundred and fifty acres, really? man. That's awesome. Look at wow. this. Oh all right. Wow. So this is what do we call it? There's a lady here we call it elegant is barn. This? Like it's an elegant country. Uh, country chic. Country chic. I like elegant country, but okay. Well, whatever you want to say. All right. Look at this door. So everything in here is sanded and clean lined. This is a barn door that is just clean. There's nothing gnarly like on the other one over there. It's just a different way of using barn it's more wood. more polished. Yeah. Oh, it's smooth. See these, see these shelves? Yes. They're trimmed uh, out different, not just a chunk of wood. So this is what Bart's done. Yep. It's just different. Just uh, a different a different carpenter. Um, the, oh, and that, that's so sweet. Lori just said glad you didn't go to Australia because you wouldn't be at ITA. Aw, so, that's yeah, nice. That is nice. Can you poor, imagine? Poor Lori. She don't know what she don't know. Oh, really? I'm just saying. I'd be a mate down under, I would. Oh, I imagine you and Steve Irwin would have been big friends. I'd have had me a kangy. What do you call them? A, a croc. A, 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 I'd, have, I'd have me a croc here, and I'd have me a, 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 what do they call them, kangaroos? I don't know. They call them something. A what? wallaby. A wallaby? I'd have me a wallaby, I would. Well, Anthony's probably quit watching, so. <laughs> yeah, he gave up. He gave up. Oh. oh, this house is cute. Oh, that feels so good. This, Bart built this one, right? Yeah, and it's got a sprinkler head that'll be coming down right out of there. Oh, yeah, where's that at? Oh, that hole up there. So he'll put his sprinkler in there, the toilet, and we are ready to go. Oh. Now, this is a typical RJO. Well, hey, buddy. Well, well look at you, mister. Look Hello, at you. stranger. Look at him. Ah. He's so laid back. He is laid back. Bless you. Come on. Bless you. He sneezed. Good boy. We're coming out. Oh, yeah. Super cute. And I have to say, the uh, countertops, they've been looking pretty sharp. Hey, you put some urethane on that? It pops. Took it right out of my mouth. It pops. You need a wombat. That's now this is an RJO, said. everybody. This is what you get for twenty grand. Oh, I thought you wanted me quit. Twenty grand. I thought you wanted me quit showing that. Think, no, 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 no. Listen, listen. <laughs> Can you imagine twenty thousand dollars, and you put it over here in the beach or the prairie or the forest for two years? Just leave it over there. Make payments on it. It's a twenty-first mortgage. It's paid for in two years, everybody. Amanda. Yes. Crickets. Oh. What I mean, I don't know why that? that I don't know why that just hit me. I'm like, 20 grand. Yeah. Just put it over there and let it sit for two years and pay it off. And you your home's paid for. Yeah. If you gotta live in your car for two years, I wouldn't let it pay, be paid for. Yeah. I'm serious. There's a lady here living in her car. Been in her car for a year. And she and on purpose she was doing it. Oh. Actually doing it because she wanted it. Okay. All right. That makes sense. It does make they sense. Dave Ramsey would, apply, would, would approve, Amanda. I'm with you. Look at him. Oh, he'd give up. <laughs> well, I'm just going to lay here and chew the rug. He's so good. He's a good pup. He is. Now, All right. Are we ready to show this one? Everybody, here okay. we go. I want them to see this one. Ready? Ta da da da. Steve, I hope you like your house. Is that not cool? Oh my God. And the whole house is just leaning. It is it's just leaning out like that. Oh my God. It, it is. Davis is going to be unique. It really is. Isn't that cool, man? He's got some windows on the other side, too. Okay. Let's go look at that. Yeah, go around that corner. That is just, they're having fun oh building it, gosh. too. Oh, my gosh. Look at, Randy, you can see. Come here and look at that it's through here. You can see. It's all crooked. Oh, my gosh. <laughs> That's wow. a bay window. Yeah, oh, you know, he didn't get to put the windows on this side yet. 
but let me, yeah. See the roof line, how it's crooked and sloping? And get this, this is our first home we get to use wood shake shingles on the roof. Oh, on the roof. On the roof, yeah. yep. And those two red let windows, of course, would be cocked. Oh my gosh, look Isn't at that. Neat? Look at there. That looks beautiful, doesn't it? Now, he is traveling with this, correct? Yep. Now, if you can't tell by this right here, but this whole side of the roof is longer than the other side. Oh my God. They're doing great, man. Yeah, that's cool though. Now tell me, what tiny home company can do that, yeah. right? That, well, put it this way, that's willing to do that because and, it is hard to do stuff like and this. And be done in three or four weeks. That's amazing. I mean, that's a specialty home and it's, we're going to get it Super done special. like we would any other home. Oh my gosh. Yeah. I love that. Probably four weeks. It'll take it'll take he's some not time. On here. I don't know if he's on here or not. Yeah. Isn't that neat? Okay. This is a good seen this yet. That's, oh, a that's a good, good sight. Angle. Yeah. Look at there. So we've got rusted metal, barn wood, cedar shakes, um, board and batten, reclaimed lumber, uh, rust just all kinds of cool stuff yeah. going on the outside of that thing. And Albert and Jeff, who's, who's working Albert, on Jeff, yeah, in Dakota. Albert, yep. Jeff, and Dakota. Yeah. Yeah, David said that'll draw all the kids' attention going down the road, for sure. Yeah, now he lives out west in Utah, and they're actually going to use this as an RV. Yeah. So they've got storage tanks, gray water, black water, fresh water, pumps, the whole wow. deal, just like an RV. Hey, and Teresa said, are they going to be putting a crooked stove pipe out of it? Yep, we've got a crooked stove so. pipe. That's sure does. Cool. Yep. That's going to be fun. Yeah. Yeah, okay. Now, isn't that pretty? My goodness. Tell I me. Mean, the canary in the coal mine right there. That is beautiful. That is the canary in the coal mine. Yeah. That is beautiful. And that's the investor house. We should name it that. So we got, this is the investor, this is yeah. one of the investors, then those two down there. Isn't that pretty? I love that yellow. Yeah. And of course, there's the outdoor shower again we featured to you guys. That is cool. Yep. That looks really good. Let me buy it. So you got the yellow, you got the green. Yes. Um, the one with the reverse loft and an RJO. Uh, they made a good point. That is sunflower colors, Teresa. It, yeah, sunflower. it's like sunflower. Oh, it'd be pretty. The big sunflower. On there, yeah, it? it would. Oh, that'd be pretty. <laughs> That's a Alex said, How do you hang shades in a crooked window? <laughs> we'll see. We'll see. Hey, that could be another show. <laughs> hey, think about it, everybody. Let me move this scaffold for you. Yeah, I just had a thought. I really like, I really like this new design. I don't get online very much to look around at tiny homes, but the ones I have seen in the past and the one I've looked, they have, of course, the fenders, right? Mm -hmm. Does this not look just better with no fenders? It does. Yeah, I see what you're saying. Mm -hmm. You know, and we, we were always, when I first started the business, I always wanted as much volume as I could possibly right. get, right, with the lofts and all. We had 52 inches in a loft. Mm -hmm. 52. I don't know anybody in the country that had that. Drop axles and all that stuff. Right. Then when we changed up our materials yes. and we changed up our design to keep our costs down and we came up with this trailer design, yes. I don't know. I really, it, it, it is really, you could take those wheels off, plop it down on a permanent foundation. It's just a, like a regular house. Put skirting around and it's done. It's done. Mm -hmm. It's done. Yeah. So, I don't know, I'm sure there's probably companies, you know, there's all kinds of great builders out there building some really cool stuff. Where's the front door? Is it on the other side? It's on the other side. side. Let's see, see if I can get a shot of that. Oh, look at this yellow. Yeah, they're coming in tomorrow trying to finish these up, get them out of here. Yeah, we've been waiting on, like I said, our cabinet shop was a little behind. And um, so we just been doing other things. Love, love it. Hi, honey. 
me see what's inside. Oh man, yeah, we showed we showed this one yesterday with the uh, child yeah, shower. Yeah, with the big barn door. In the tub shower, yeah. Ace, where'd you find a chicken, buddy? I mean, that's my decor. Here, we'll put them in here. That's my chicken. Come on. Somebody took my chicken. Ain't that something? Amanda. Yes, sir. Enough. Why is my In here. See the tub shower? <laughs> oh, this bathroom. Is it's Look how big. Randy. Look at this thing. A nice tall vanity. Oh. Water heater underneath it. The toilet, a closet. Oh this is my awesome. goodness. This is an unbelievable bathroom. Yeah, this is awesome. I mean, you got room to walk around in here. Wow. Can't believe it. Look, oh, let me not get in the shadow of it. Look at the shower. That is one huge bathroom. Wow, wow, wow. Yeah, yes. man. And that is a good soaking tub. Look here. Such a big bathroom. Come on in. Oh my gosh. Hey, and buddy. Here's the, like a closet. I need to give you a bath, Ace. Oh, God, all the dogs need a bath. I mean, he was, we went in that, the uh, forest yesterday. Yeah. He sunk up to his belly in mud. <laughs> oh my gosh. Wow, nice layout. Does that window open? Uh, yes. Everything. That window does open. Mm -hmm. What kind of window is that called? I call it a hopper window. Yeah. Actually, you know what these windows were made for is basements. Yes, correct. In a residential home, I get them from Lowe's, they're $49.99.99. <laughs> what year currency? Yep. So in a rental, and you guys, you know, think about it. This is really a good rental. Ah, it's, it's a good living because you got your bedroom up top. That is a massive loft. Mm -hmm. You've got an air exchanger up there, egress window, big king size bed with room to spare. All yeah. right. This with your kitchen on this side. Look what a big barn door. Man. But, man, look, you still got room for, a, for actually a sofa, a dining room table if you would like, right? You could actually put, look. A clothes rack back here, a little, yeah. you could later on have an armoire built or a cabinet or shelves, something oh, wow. else. Yep. Can you move that over there so they can see the kitchen? Mm -hmm. Thank you. Yeah, the bathroom's like half the house. It and is. It's still with room. How, and what size again was it? 8 by 20. I mean a 10 by 20. Man. Yep. The room. Love it. And this is an RJO kitchen. So you got your, look, the drawers, the two here, the drawer on the bottom, you know, My two cabinets. Goodness. Tell me, why. I mean, why else do you need, you know? Awesome. Mm. And everybody listen too. You can actually, and I've always said this, and Dana had made the comment about, a, you know, a rack over the um, power box. Yeah. Do that stuff after you get in. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Make all them changes and build them and buy them at yard sales and Facebook and Maybe IKEA. Buy unique or something. Yeah, you know? I really think, in, and I always, you know, called it morphing into your home. Mm -hmm. Wait till you live in it because you may not want a cabinet there. It may be too cumbersome. You may want open shelves. You may want a coat rack. You may want a TV there. You know? Yeah. Look, he's got a shoe now. Goodness. Now this one doesn't have lights on it, but they had it. Well, wait a minute. It's got some power. I don't know if it's got power turned. Let's see. Oh yeah, I think it does. I can feel the air conditioning on in here. Nope. Nope. It sure don't, Amanda. Wait a minute. It was a power. Let's see here. What do we got? Water heater. Lights. There we go. Yay, 
outside lights. There you go, Amanda. All right. Hey, what, what size is this one? Oh, yeah, come on in here. And she's going to like, my gosh, every time we walk in, there's Lord, stuff all over the floor. <laughs> oh, my God. What a mess. Miss Meitcher, I want to make sure if you haven't seen this after I've destroyed your last name my a thousand goodness. times, I put you in a Randy rack. All right. And also, I love this drawer. And this was a suggestion from a, a new customer we're yeah. going to have. And I've actually stacked the drawers for her. But we put that in. And you can actually access this big empty space under there. Yes. By those two doors. Oh, yeah. A lot of space. Right? Beautiful. So you got the cooktop, range hood. Um, the mini split is really cool. You can feel the, how it's working oh, real well. Oh, it feels great. And then, of course, the big picture window behind you. Mm-hmm. The vinyl floor, and here's your washer, stackable washer and dryer. This is where the fridge will go, so I'll stand yeah. where the fridge is. And I'll stand where the washer and dryer goes, man. How's that? Oh, hello, friend. Hello, friend. <laughs> Social distancing. Social distancing. Yep. In a big loft. Yeah. Right? So, and she's got a storage loft, sleeping loft, big kitchen, dining room area, congregating, sofa, whatever you want in here, right? Yeah. Love it. And of course, another soaking tub. Now, this is not tile <clears throat> because tile is an upgrade. It's, you know, it's quite expensive, mm -hmm. but that's pretty, isn't it? I love that. Beautiful, man. So you put you know, maybe an arched bar here for your no curtain. no stairs. No stairs are going No in stairs, no. just a ladder. Yep. It's kind of hard to put stairs, it's, you know, when you got an eight foot wide home. But a beautiful vanity. She can have a mirror here, lots of room for all kinds of stuff that you can just man grow into right here oh, you know yeah what? lord what a mess ain't that <laughs> awful i need to find a broom all right let me shut her down and this is the vinyl flooring hey i was gonna i was gonna oh. i'm done Hey, I'm going to mention something to y'all. See this vinyl flooring? Yeah. We are selling a ton of it. And you get it from Lowe's. So this is a Lowe's product. We're installing it the way they want us to. All right. Beautiful. Yeah. Okay. I have found, don't know if it's happened in any home yet, but in that little cube that I'm in, Okay, the floor is not insulated like these are, but what I found was, as I left the door open to my cube, I usually leave the doors and windows open all day when I'm working mm -hmm. and stuff. So, but when I went into the cube today, the sun was coming in the door and it hit the vinyl. Well, vinyl, if you've ever put vinyl siding up, vinyl will expand and contract, mm. okay? So that's why when they put this floor down, they don't put the floor... You don't put the cabinets on top of the vinyl. Right. Everything's in, and then we put the vinyl down. Yes. Even the baseboards that are around here, the reason we have to use a baseboard is because there is a quarter to half inch gap between the vinyl and the wall. That's it. So everything has to be able to move and give. Mm -hmm. Now, I didn't look into the, in the cube that I'm staying in, but where the sun was actually hitting it, mm -hmm. it bubbled up. It rose about an inch. Okay. Oh, oh, yeah. So I'm going to look and see, but I just hope that this product doesn't. So if she has their door open and the sun hits that, the room that we have, it's supposed to expand. Mm -hmm. All right. And contract with hot and cold. Yeah. Yeah. Don't you do your business. Don't you, you get out there. Come on. Let's go, Ace. Start to sniff like Good boy. One. You never know when he's going to let one go. No. Oops. Yeah. So, uh, you know, this is a product from Lowe's and they sell millions of it. We're doing it. I just found it today. So I just wanted to let you know we're, we're going to look into that. But I thought it was kind of something to maybe think about and tell you how we install it. And it's to give it some expansion and contraction. Okay. Yeah. So, 
Look at this building, Amanda. Wow. It's yeah, beautiful. Well, you can show the greenhouse. The green. The so right here before the yellow. You want to run in there? Oh, two greenhouses. We didn't see either one of those. Well, this is the big 10 by 28. Which both of them dark. That puts a steam shower in it. No, no, no. Steam shower's outside. What is wrong? Why do I always think it's that one? Okay. This is the one with the handicapped shower. Okay, yes, yes. Big right. bathroom, 10 by 28. Love, love this house. This is the house that you will see at the resort. These are the homes. 10 by 28, 30, 26. This home that right size. here, gorgeous. 58,000 to 66,000, double dormers, finished floors. You buy the deck package on that thing, you get a deck and a shed That's and awesome. underpinning and everything. Yeah. And this green and plot with man, this turned out smooth. And this is the other investment home. It's got the outdoor shower, and this is the one with, the, with a, a tiled tub shower. Ooh. It's a tiled shower. Yeah, yes. not a tub shower. Beautiful. And I don't think it has this electricity. One, we got to show it really quick because... They did not flip your barn door yet. Uh, and this is countertop. Yes, we So gotta Will see will that. be back here to do that. Oh, yeah, for yeah. sure. Can you still see in here? A little bit, but I, I just want to show them that. Hey, buddy. Oh, there's the... Um, grapevines. Grapevines. And they are going to turn that. Yep, and it's got the pebble... Stone shower. Let me see if I can see it. Maybe too dark. And the subway tile. You can see it some. Yeah, you can see it some. Pretty. What do you, what do you think, Ace? Pretty. What do you think, buddy? Beautiful. Good boy. There's the subway tile. Good boy. Good boy. Nice. Good boy. Come on, let's go. Yeah. Come on. I bet you're gonna have a hard time coming down there, aren't you? Look at you. What a good job. He did awesome. Okay, got it. I mean, we ran through them. I mean, we did. We're starting another one here. Yes. All right, tomorrow, um, we're starting two more, setting up some trailers, mm -hmm. getting them two done. We have come up with a strategy today, and I'm not gonna tell you what it is. Oh. But we it's have, a secret. but we have, we, you guys, you know, it's, it's like telling it before Christmas, you, what your gifts are going to be. We have everybody so much on high alert of trying to produce these homes yes. and a more quicker way. Okay. Mm -hmm. Just faster building. And it's, it's taken some time to get that together. We've been building, we've been building almost 12 a month Yeah. and we're going to try. We think we have a way of doing this for a month or two, pull our output. Oh, right. That'd be unbelievable. That's a big feat. And like my dad said, I could drill the big auger. Sure all right. Do. But I've got all these guys on board. So we came up with a plan. You stay tuned for the next four or five weeks and see what we do to come up with it. So if you're waiting on your home, believe me, the next 20 to 26, seven homes, we're going to try to actually get those things out in the next five weeks. All right. That's our attempt. There's a lot to do with that. You know, when you build that many homes, you need to have all your windows, all your metal, all your siding, all your traders, all your, you know, this, this, the, the plumbing fittings, the showers. There's just so many things you got to have. And you got to have them beforehand. You have to have an inventory team to take care of inventory. And then on top of that, with our software program, the Co Construct is going to help mm -hmm. us categorize all this and keep you as homeowners, right, active in the growth of your home. Yep. And we can keep track of all your emails so we won't lose any emails. It's not that we lose them, but when you have three or four different addresses, all that will be in one file. Your pictures, your videos, the ANSI inspections, your certification. We're excited about the future of this. It was going to be a big year. It's a huge year. Bigger than I, it's actually bigger than what I thought it was coming yeah. on. And also don't forget about our resort across the street of 162 acres, 15 more customers and we have until huh? it haven't we have until may 25th may 25th now if we can get before that i would love to almost in quarantine the guys we are actually staying away from each other working uh they go straight home they come straight here they're not trying to interact with anything outside there we're not having yeah. visitors here unique place that we're able to work and keep our distance from each other. But business-wise, been busier. Yeah. 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 
It makes so much sense, everybody, when you think about it. You can buy a twenty to thirty-five, forty thousand dollar home, and if you do put it on an overnight rental, it could almost pay half of it off with the deal we're giving you guys is two years free management fee. Mm -hmm. Even if you didn't have that, you can actually, if you could afford to keep it even somewhere else here, right. you know, it's a good investment. So it's it's a good money thing. What you got? Uh, and two, I just want to get. They said you can decorate the gray one and a totally planned. Okay. Thing. Yep. Yep. Uh, her her yep. A twenty container, and also uh, Brian uh, Cardi, him and Mary, was wanting to know: are, is their house certified? And talk about the certification. Yeah, all the houses will be certified. Will be certified. None. They're not right now. Mm -hmm. Yeah, but, but we will be. Yeah, we talked to the ANSI certification, mm -hmm. and um, he told us what we need to do. All of them will be certified. Yes, yeah. yes, they will. And two, on Monday, because there's another one that's starting up there. Yeah. On Monday, we will announce the new ones that are, have come in the shop. Tom told me today who they are, but we'll wait till Monday until they're actually. We have 12 trailers coming. Actually, mm -hmm. 13. Ordered another one today. We're trying to expedite them. Uh, we should get maybe half or more out of here at the you know mid end of next week get all these out of here setting them up and we're excited about what's going on yeah all right everybody and we're glad uh cindy's on here and i know she's told some of her stories that cindy's had a really hard time in her life and stuff yeah. like that and cindy we her house is ready and waiting whenever she can come and uh we we think of cindy a lot so she's a good friend to us yeah, yeah. yep she's been good to us and we've tried to help her and mm -hmm. um it's a beautiful home it's the hobbit house and I've lived in it. We've used it as an office. She's been sweet to us, and mm -hmm. we've taken good care of her. And of course, um, customers that we've had a chance to to get to know and do. Um, so hey, we went from the backyard to here. I know and the war. It's still a fight, and sure it, you know is. it will be till the end. It will. That's just life. It is. It's business. Being self-employed, mm -hmm. you got to work or you don't eat. That's right. Okay. Mm -hmm. So everybody have a great weekend. I'm Randy Jones with Incredible Tiny we Homes. Might Maybe this weekend, maybe not. Ace, where you going, buddy? Let's say goodnight. Come, Come here, here, buddy. Now. Where'd you go? He went right through there. Come here, boy. And I'm going to post some pictures on Facebook. <laughs> Me and Woo Woohoo! Good job, buddy. And Ace took a walk at lunchtime, and I took a bunch of pictures of the forest and the, the trail. That Don't bite me. Through. Don't bite me. Don't bite me. Look at him. Rawr, rawr, rawr. <laughs> Good boy, good boy. Hey, let me see if I got a snack. I got one? Look, I'm teasing him. I don't have oh, one. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> good boy. Oh, that's me. Okay, Aww. watch. Sit. Look how cute he is. He's so cute. Good boy. Good boy. So now you just get loving. <laughs> Bye, everybody. Bye. Have, have a, a great, great Thank you for watching all week. We'll be back maybe over the weekend. I'd hey, love there to be a house behind you too. There'll be a house here tomorrow we're going to put up. And uh, I think I'd love to go to the resort again. We might do that this week. So weekend. if it doesn't rain, I want to show you some more parts of the resort. I was actually thinking about maybe <laughs> we may do some bush hogging over there Ooh, and some clearing yeah. next week. So if I can get a little of that done, give you a really good clue of how it's going to look. Hey, Sunday would be a good time. I've got to do yard work tomorrow. Yeah. Look at him. What do you got in your mouth now? <laughs> Bye, everybody. You just give me that. Give me Look there, you ready? Where did you go? Good, I'd run too. <laughs> Night, everybody. Good night. Thank you. Yeah. Come on, buddy. Arr. <laughs>